I was going to say, Chris, they really match, I think, this year. I'm not sure that was the case last year, and I don't mean just in the bubble. I mean the way Phoenix was not up to the task. Their first two baskets from three-point range. Makes it tough on, on, when you're thinking about Crowder for him to get go out. If Miles Turner is making it three, what they did was start to run him off that three-point line, uh, Phoenix off the three-point line, and they really struggled after that. And not struggling and getting to the rim. He's got seven straight Oladipo. Pacers got to cut him off. Phoenix 8 of 13. The Pacers 7 of 13. Fading oh, and sweet, scoring. Sweet Sabonis. And Booker hadn't even been a part of their offense. And Crowder for three. And block out there by Miles Turner, who's running. Throw him the ball. Miles Turner, who's running. Throw him the ball. Yeah, throw him the ball. He's, he worked hard. This is the, the, the kind of intelligence you need to have on all your players. Yesterday, a new baby boy in the McConnell household, and uh, we send our best to the family. Yeah, blessings to them. Uh, that is a great blessing. As Javon Carter is in, and they find Crowder in the corner, and he missed it. Uh, these, you know, Western Conference teams normally play at a, at a fast pace. His teams, his guys guard you, and that's what Carter does. Sabonis got Aiton in the air and then just goes right by him on the baseline. Second of three straight on the road. They're in Washington on Monday. Johnson, long three. Johnson, baseline, finds Paul wide open as Carter. Well, that's the one, you, that's who you'd rather shoot it. Of everybody they have on the floor with the exception of Aiton on the inside. You gotta get, you gotta help him. Now McDermott. That's the way to help you. When the season started, I would have not predicted that. No, I don't think many people would have. Many people didn't know how much he still had left in the tank. Tough shot over eight left-handed by Justin Holiday. But that's that's part of the game. I mean, I, I don't disagree with you there. Now Sabonis against Aiton. Not sure he was indecisive. how important he is to that second unit. He said his pace on offense is crucial because he flies out of the corner. He attacks the rim. He creates so much space, guys. He's shooting just 31% three entering the game, but having a really productive start because of his movement. And not only, I agree with you that it's his movement, but he's a guy that, that shoots it at such a high percentage. People like McDermott, a, a laser, a guy who's going to knock down three-point shots. He's just struggling at the moment. Quinn, have we seen his game? Shot clock, deep and solid. And Simonis the rebound, and he's going to bring it all the way up the floor. And Simonis the rebound, and he's going to bring it all the way up the floor, and then retrieve it. Nope, he lost it. Well, he lost it. One, he was in traffic trying to capture it. Good defense by Brogdon great. to cut off Booker. Yeah, great recovery. Because Booker likes to go left to shoot his jump shot. Pacers lead by four. That's that three-point shot, you know, three-point corner. He's hit three of them, and that dings the rim. Cameron Johnson misses. He's a 40% shooter out there. Now the Pacers look to build on that two-possession lead. Sabonis dials three. Johnson fumbles it and missed the three. And he's getting ready to get the rebound, though. Bridges is ready to help. And Sabonis couldn't get it in over eight. Because he ran into that pit. Sabonis sets his feet for three. It's off the mark. Now Booker drives it right inside and a foul. Well, he was complaining about a foul two possessions ago, Chris. T.J. McConnell is out after the birth of his son. And Crowder does a great job of drawing the foul on Sabonis. Brogdon again couldn't finish, but he had oh, my Sabonis goodness. got his own rebound and draws the foul. Brogdon again couldn't finish, but he had oh, my Sabonis goodness. got his own rebound and draws the foul.
Brogdon again couldn't finish, but he had oh, my Sabonis got his own rebound and draws the foul. So he did his dirty work while the ball was in the air. He has matched his season high with 13 rebounds. He had 11 in the first half. I believe at this point he's been struggling to score. He's just trying to figure out the best, way, you know, the other best ways to make a contribution. They're looking to try to get Aiton into the game. Because they're looking to try to get another foul on, on Turner. I mean on uh, Sabonis. But Sabonis played him just like he should. Booker. Uh, Booker's good enough. That can hit the top of the backboard, not go over and go in. I was glad to see that bounce over, bounce back. Now Oladipo. Sabonis missed in the first half and misses again. He's 0 for 3. You can get blocked out in, in a heartbeat. Played three minutes of the third quarter. Sabonis spins. Aiton is there, and Sabonis got the roll. Nice job getting to that left hand. 13 points, 11 rebounds. Oladipo challenges to the rim. Sabonis the rebound, fouled by Paul. Nice job by Sabonis. Two more free throws for Sabonis. 67% on the year. That look good. He puts himself in position to get fouled, Chris. I mean, he works at it. That good. was Miles Turner. So the defense was really good. Sabonis backs in. Booker to help with a left hand short. He lost the handle on it. Because he was right at the rim and passed it out. Good smart play. Because if a team is, is spotty shooting, a zone will really throw their rhythm off. What a good pass by Miles Turner. Showing some signs of growth there. He read the play before he had the ball made it. Oladipo gets inside, and it is rebounded by Sabonis. Counting a foul. A chance for a three-point play. Oladipo gets inside, and it is rebounded by Sabonis. Counting a foul. A chance for a three-point play. Oladipo gets inside, and it is rebounded by Sabonis. Counting a foul. A chance for a three-point play. Oladipo gets inside, and it is rebounded by Sabonis. Counting a foul. A chance for a three-point play. And he got his own rebound. I'm all right, partner. You know, this is a team game. I'm sorry. Don't want to mislead the people. I had to give you the assist. I, I, very well done. Well said. Again, they've taken Aiden out of the game. Now Sabonis puts it in and a foul. Carter commits the foul. And Turner with the offensive rebound. Take it to score it. Yep. And Turner with the offensive rebound. Take it to score it. Yep. So they've got that small lineup. That's why Monty Williams is calling timeout. Because they didn't block out. Pacers took advantage of it. 12 of 32 from behind the arc. They're 4 of 10 in the third. Good read. Really good read. And they've gone to a 2-3 zone. What a catch and what a pass. Those are your two big guys. 19 in the quarter for Sabonis. He's got 23. That defensive possession belongs to Miles Turner. And, and you could see the frustration in his face. He was not going to allow that to happen tonight. And when I say a particularly good game, by his standards. And, and you could see the frustration in his face. He was not going to allow that to happen tonight. And when I say a particularly good game, by his standards. Turner backs it out, but another offensive but, rebound. But he backed it Pacers. out to give Sabonis a chance to post up because he sees him on Sarage for center. That's a great read. Turner fights, but Aiton got the rebound. When they have been impressive, the Phoenix Suns, they've uh -oh. had a good start to the year. They have a different mindset, Chris. This, is, this isn't the Phoenix Suns team from last year from a personnel standpoint. Their mindset is totally different. Out of the timeout. Couple of baskets, four-point lead, oh. and Pacers turn it over again. Yeah, that, that's just a bad pass there. I, I'm not sure where Sabonis was throwing that. 
Spinning with four to shoot. He's just strong enough to move him. I really didn't think that was good because they're hungry, even I, though it's the second out of a back-to-back. -back. Oh, I agree. I, I totally agree with you. I was concerned when they did it. The Pacers got a very good chance to win this because I think you can run their legs out, but I didn't like, I'd much rather them had one and take this one for granted. And Sabonis can't get that three to go. Turn around. And Sabonis lays it in. Oladipo is still waiting at the scores bench because we've not had a stoppage in play. And Sabonis, an offensive rebound basket. Oladipo is still waiting at the scores bench because we've not had a stoppage in play. And Sabonis, an offensive rebound basket. You're right, his performance through the first three quarters did not sit well with Mar Malcolm Brogdon, 22. Phoenix has matched its season high point total. They scored 123 at home against Toronto on Wednesday.